Hi and welcome back to another one of the video features for the Immersive Worlds Handbook and today I'm at Cabela's outside of Reno, Nevada and I want to talk to you just briefly about the value of telling stories in branded retail spaces and I'm here at one of their amazing uh, taxidermy walls and you could see just the uh, extent to which they focus on creating an immersive uh, space within the store uh, near the rear of the store uh, but right here in front of me is a plaque that is uh, telling a bit of story of uh, Dan Avery, an avid mule deer hunter and it tells um, a pretty uh, detailed story about his life and it looks like uh, his uh, son's uh, experience too and uh, one of the things we shouldn't forget if we're designing retail spaces is that stories go um, a heck of a long way. If you're telling the story of the outdoors uh, you can be assured that you're connecting with the enthusiast who's coming to the space not just to buy something but to, but to think about his or her life in relationship to the goods and the experiences that you're selling. REI has figured this out quite clearly. Um, other stores like uh, Bass Pro uh, Shops, Outdoor World, uh, Shields, World of Sports and so forth, they've all figured out the value of telling a story uh, and hopefully a story that resonates with the guest because the guest wants to think uh, you're not just you know selling me something but you're also telling me who I am or helping me realize my own life story as I move through your space, as I buy equipment, as I go out into the world, into nature and experience um, my own life uh, through the, uh, the world of outdoor enthusiasm and, and sports, uh, extreme sports, hunting, fishing, and so forth. So let's not forget the value of uh, telling a story in uh, the new experiential branded stores like Cabela's here in Reno, Nevada.